Welcome to Upgrade with Dave and Sonia. I'm Dave. And I have a clever way of keeping your lithium batteries warm during the winter time. So let's climb into the truck. So while I climb into this truck, if you like this kind of information, subscribe to our channel. So, so this is the solar setup inside the truck. And then this is my battery. And it's covered up right now to help keep it warm. But I have three heaters in, underneath there. So here's the battery underneath the towel. And get about 50, 55 degrees. See a low of 52. We have 58. So now let's take the towel off. So let's uncover it. So I have two towels, one covering these two sides and then this towel actually is underneath in the front on that side, which is the back. And it's also on the top. So the on-off switch is on this side, the display is on this side. But my heaters these are elbow heaters for pipes. And so you would stick that to a, a pipe and it'll keep your pipe from freezing. So you have three of these heaters. One's here and one right here, up and down. And then I have one on the back side against the, the bed of the truck. Those three are all wired in parallel. And then I have them running off of an output from the MPPT charge controller. So I can turn it on and off if I need to. I don't, I just leave it on. So in the summertime, I'll unplug these two connections here. And then I'll plug the fan back in. But for right now, I have 0.9 amps feeding three of these units. They're rated at four watts a piece. So 0.9 amps times the 13 volts gives me 12 watts. So I am using four watts a piece. 12 watts for 24 hours. It runs consistent. There's no thermostat on here controlling them. So I use 288 watt hours a day. And my solar panels pretty much keep up with that. So with the one towel removed, I have 56 over in this corner. Where the electrical connection is. About also 56. Down right where the heater is. We see 75. And this was a corner that was high. So 66. Sixty-four. Same with the back. We're in the hot spot, it's 80, 85, 86. I don't see any other cold spots there. It's 61. So in summary, it's 40 degrees outside today and the battery the lowest temperature we saw was about 50 degrees. I have three heaters on there. I have been outside when it was in the teens, so the high teens, I think it was 18 or 19 degrees. And I didn't see the battery go below 40 degrees. But I am going to keep an eye on it. We'll check it periodically. I do have some additional heaters. And if I need to, I will put 
one, maybe two heaters on the very bottom. I could put one up on the front. I don't really want to put one on the front. But I think if anything, I might need them on the bottom. I did determine that putting the two towels on really made a big difference also. So I was able to keep the battery warmer, keeping the heat inside, keeping the cold air from just being right against the batteries. So having this towel, which is on the far side, the front, the top, and on the bottom, and then the red towel that I had, I have on this side, and I tucked back behind where the wiring is. <clears throat> so if you like these kind of videos, make sure you subscribe to our channel here and then watch these other videos down here. Have a good day.